Hello one and all, I'm back. And now it's time for part two of the Full Metal Jacket experience. <clears throat> so without further ado, let's get started. Ten fucking seconds! It should take you no less than ten fucking seconds to negotiate this obstacle. There ain't one swinging dick private in this platoon is gonna graduate until I can get this obstacle down in less than ten fucking seconds. Next two privates, get up there. Private Joker, are you a killer? Sir, yes, sir. Let me hear your war cry. Ah! Next two privates, quickly. Get your fat ass up there, Private Pile. Oh, yeah, that's right, Private Pile. Don't make any fucking effort to get up to the top of the fucking obstacle. If God wanted you up there, he'd have miracled your ass up there by now, wouldn't he? Sir, yes, sir. Get your fat ass up there. What the hell's the matter with you? I bet you if there was some pussy up there on top of that obstacle, you could uh, get up there. Sir, yes, sir. Your ass looks like a, about 150 pounds of chewed bubblegum. You know that pile? Sir, yes, sir. One for the commandant. One for the car. Get up there. Pull! I guess the car don't get theirs. Get up there, pile. Pull, pile, pull! One pull-up pile. Come on! You gotta be shitting me, pile. Get your ass up there. Do you mean to tell me that you cannot do one single pull-up? You are a worthless piece of shit, pile. Get out of my face. <coughs> Sorry about that. Now, onward with the performance. Get up here, fat boy. Move up. Hustle up. You're too slow. You climb obstacles like old people. Fuck. You know that private pile? Private pile. Whatever you do, don't fall down. That would break my fucking heart. Well, what are you waiting for, private pile? Get up and over. Are you quitting on me? Well, are you? Then quit, you slimy-looking, walrus-looking piece of shit. Get the fuck down off of my obstacle. Get the fuck off of my obstacle. Now, move it. I'm going to rip your balls off so you cannot contaminate the rest of the world. I will motivate you, Private Pile, if it short digs every cannibal on the Congo. Pick him up and sit him down, Pile. Were you born a fat, slimy scumbag? You piece of shit, Private Pile. Or did you have to work on it? Hustle it up. The fucking war will be over there. Be over by the time we get up there, won't it, Private Pile? Are you going to die, Pile? Are you going to do die? Then do it. Do it now. Do you feel dizzy? Do you feel faint? Jesus H. Christ. I think you've got a hard on. Jesus H. Christ. Private Pile. Why is your footlocker unlocked? Sir, I don't know, sir. Private Pile, if there is one thing I hate, it is an unlocked footlocker. You know that. Sir, yes, yeah, sir. If it wasn't for dickheads like you, there wouldn't be any thievery in this world. Now, would there? Sir, no, sir. Now, get down. Well, now. Let's just see if there's anything missing. <laughs> Holy Jesus. What is that? What in the fuck is that? What is that, Private Pile? Sir, a jelly donut, sir. A jelly donut. Sir, yes, sir. Is Chow allowed in the barracks, Private Pile? Sir, no, sir. Are you allowed to eat jelly donuts, Private Pile? Sir, no, sir. And why not, Private Pile? Sir, because I'm too heavy, sir. Because you are a disgusting fat body. You know that, Private Pile. Sir, yes, sir. Then why did you hide a jelly donut in your footlocker, Private Pile? Sir, because I was hungry, sir. Because you were hungry. Private Pile has dishonored himself and dishonored the platoon. I have tried to help him, but I have failed. I have failed because you have not helped me. You have not given Private Pyle the proper motivation. So, from now on, whenever Private Pyle fucks up, I will not punish him. I will punish all of you. And the way I see it, ladies, you all owe me for one jelly donut. Now get on your faces. Open your mouth. They're paying for it. You eat it. One, two, three, four, I love the Marine Corps. One, two, three, 
four, I love the Marine Corps. One, two, three, four, I love the Marine Corps. Now, now, finally, we get to the best part. We get to Private Pyle's greatest hour and Gunnery Sergeant Hartman's final hour. Well, actually, it was both their final hours, but oh well. <laughs> Hi, Joker. Leonard. Leonard, are those live rounds? Seven, six, two millimeter. Full metal jacket. If Hartman comes in here and catches us, we'll both be in a world of shit. I am in a world of shit. Left shoulder, huh. right shoulder, huh. lock and low. Order, huh. this is my rifle. There are many like it, but this one is mine. My rifle is my best friend. Door opens. Get back in your bunks. I must... It is my life. I must master it as I must master my life. Without me, my rifle is useless. What in the name of Jesus H. Christ are you animals doing in my head? Why is Private Pyle out of his bunk after lights out? Why is Private Pyle holding that weapon? Why aren't you stomping Private Pyle's guts out? Sir, it is the private's duty to inform the senior drill instructor that Private Pyle has a full magazine and is locked and loaded. Sir! Now you listen to me, Private Pyle, and you listen good. I want that weapon, and I want it now. You will place that rifle on the deck at your feet and step back away from it. What is your major malfunction, num nuts? Didn't mommy and daddy show you enough attention when you were a child? And then he sits down on the uh, toilet and uh, shoots himself. Bye bye, pile. Bye bye, Sergeant Hart. Gunnery Sergeant Hartman. So, anyway, that concludes this video. Um, if you liked it, like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. And uh, even if you, whether you lo love or hate my video, I'd appreciate it if you left a donation. It's for a good cause. And uh, if you're interested, and if to learn more, just click the link and you'll see. So anyway, till next time, adios, amigos.